lately I've been thinking about all the things we talked about, all the places we would go, all the things that we would do, disappeared without a trace, all the lies were to my face, telling me that you're okay, but it was someone else okay, when I saw you had a kiss, I felt anger with happiness, I want you to live happily, but how could you do this to me, and how we had no Is like a drug to me, so listen to my heartbeat. Don't you let it go? When you said you loved me, no one had to know. Girl, you're original, and I know what you're gonna say. Boy, put on your game face, or you should run away. I keep making you love sick to drown in all the pain. You're just another hopeless coming my way. Hit the brakes and get ready for the heart. All my love 
And don't ever give it up this time Cause my heart's had enough But your touch is like a drug to me So I put on my game face and I won't run away I kept getting love sick to drowning all the pain But now I'm not a hopeless coming your way The gas girl, get ready for the heartbreak Yeah Get ready for the heartbreak Hey, hey, hey. All right. Welcome. So today I'm going to be playing a little uh, KSP, a little Kerbal Space Program. Um, it's been a while since I've played this game. Uh, it's probably been like maybe a year or two. Uh, I have about 20, 25 hours in the game. So not a ton compared to, I think, what a lot of people have in this. But yeah, we're gonna start a new game. Uh, we'll go career here. Call this uh, Twitch sesh. Gotta change the flag up. Oh man, let's see, so many flags. Mm, I'm a fan of... Man. Mm. A lot of different flags. Let's do uh Part of me wants the NASA flag, but that's so that's too vanilla. Too vanilla. Um oh, the purple one. Kind of like Kerbal One, we're gonna go with that. All right, so we're gonna go career mode. Funds, reputation, and science are all active, and contracts are available at Mission Control. Oh man, this is normal. What's moderate like? Oh geez, no crew responds. About 10,000 left on the starting funds. 
Resource abundance, 80% re-entry, heating 100%. I think we're going to go moderate. Oof, yikes. This might be a quick game right here. This might be a quick game. So I'm not using any mods. So I know when I played this in the past, there was a mod that, uh, like, throw onto your rocket and it essentially just, like, flew for you. Like, you just go to the map and, like, click and it would get you to wherever you wanted to go. We're not going to do that. At least I'm going to try to avoid it if possible. And play the authentic experience here. All right, welcome to Space Center. I'm Gene Kerman, flight director and your guide for this quick introduction. This is the Space Center. From here, you can manage all aspects of the space program. Feel free to have a look around. Hold the right mouse button to move the camera. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Or use the arrow keys. Yeah, cool, got it. Right click over the Space Center facilities to learn more about them and left click when you're ready to head inside. If you need more information, check out the training section on the main menu. Thank you. I've got it. What was that guy's name? Gene Kerman or something? Uh, all right. Level one vehicle assembly, R&D, level one. Astronaut complex, what is this? Administration building, hangar, launch pad, and the tracking station. Uh, I mean, I just want, I want to get right into building the rocket, but I feel like maybe I should see if there's a contract here I can get. All right, we got Mortimer Kerman, Linus Kerman, Walt Kerman, and Gus Kerman. Gus looks like the man. Actually, Walt looks pretty cool too. He hasn't shaved in a little while. Walt Kerman. He looks like, uh, I wonder, is it, that's not like a shot at Breaking Bad, is it? He's like wearing like a little meth suit. I'm pretty sure that's not, but like Walter White, Walt Kerman, just public relations. That's, I don't know. I think I'm overthinking it. All right, so what is there to do? Is there anything to do here? Anything to pick up? Bailout grant? In dire straits? Okay. So, it doesn't look like there's anything for me to get here, right? Uh, that's where I just was, right? R&D tracking station. Let's just go ahead and build a rocket. Let's go for it. We're here to go to space, right? Let's go to space. Uh, Werner Von Kerman. Hello, I'm Werner Von Kerman, Chief rocket Rocketry Engineer. First time I've heard that word. This is the vehicle assembly building where we build spacecraft and later roll them out to the launch pad for flight. Pretty impressive, isn't it? Yeah, I mean, you know, kind of cool. Uh, on your left, you'll find components to construct your own spacecraft. Select a starting part, then attach others to it to build a ship. You can then have a look around with the right mouse button or the arrow keys. That's it, really. It's not as if we're rocket science. Uh, <laughs> Oh man, good one. Good, good joke. Good joke. Uh, anyhow, if you need a more in-depth explanation on how to build, have a look at the training section at the main menu. Training section at the main menu. Oh, we're just not going to look at that. Training is for people. Alright. Um... So I'm gonna try to use my, my limited knowledge here from when I last played this game and just build a rocket ship. If this is grayed out, okay, so if it's grayed out, it looks like it might be available. We just don't have access to it yet. Ah, uh, variants available. Three, electric charge 50. Repellent 10, Ejection Force 10, so this is lighter, doesn't tolerate as big an impact, they have the same amount of G's, let's just throw this thing, it's kind of cool. 
Uh, are we really gonna go right to an engine? I guess we don't really have another choice, huh? And we don't have any, like, coupling to, like, detach this, so... Cool. We do have some science. Let's throw the science on there. There. And there should be, like, a... Actually, can I? Is there another stage here? Might be able to decouple. Uh, yeah, what can I look at here? This is, this menu has changed a lot. Oh my gosh. Wow. Jeez, okay. Yeah, uh, this, whoa. This is a whole new menu. That's kind of cool. There's a lot of information there to digest. Uh, so yeah, we got the science. I mean, let's just throw an engine on here and see what happens, right? I don't even know if that's going to be enough to, like, get us anywhere. Does it say how much, like, burn time's on that? It does not. Alright, that costs 200 bucks. What is this? This is going to be, uh... Uh, can be uh, little little boy one right here, little boy one, and then we can have yeah we got a parachute. Oh, I need that, and I don't know what order this goes in. Oh, so then, okay, so that does drop our mass. Uh, what if I throw some fins on? Is that going to mess it up even more? I don't know if it's possible to do this without fins. I need, oh shoot, where's the, <coughs> where's the view that shows you like... Ooh, aerodynamic, center of thrust, center of mass, and aerodynamic. Hmm. Uh, I don't really, I'm not sure we need that. Is that, that drops it a little bit. Also, wow, look at that thing. What a beaut, what a beaut right there. Just, ugh. all right, let's throw it on there and we'll see what happens. Whoever gets in this thing is good, but for sure. Oh man, Jebediah. Oh, Jebediah, RIP, RIP. All right, we're gonna save it, and oh, you can export to Steam. That's new as well. I like. I think I want this above the decouple, right? I don't know the order we're going in here. Do you go highest to lowest? Maybe you do. Reverse that. All right, let's do it. It's gonna be bad. All right, I remember the throttle, which I don't even know if this engine technically throttles, so. Uh, what's our stage? So second stage. We're gonna see if the parachute gets deployed or if we shoot off into the sky here. We want, okay, we want, uh, what is this, like stability, right, and rotation. We want those things. Let's do it. Dude, Jebediah is screwed. Oh god. Oh, hey, look at that though. We got a little something going. That's good. We're going in the right direction, kinda. Yeah, we're moving. Let's, uh, well, let's deploy the parachute. And then we can do a little science experiment while we're going. Observe it up, Jebediah. Keep the experiment. I'm gonna transmit that actually. Oh, it's inoperable after transmit. Oh shit, something blew up. Okay, yeah, we'll just keep the experiment. Where, uh, okay, my parts blew up down there. 
All right, and then we can speed up the camera to get down here. Although, can't my crew member... I'll say my crew member can do like an experience as well, right? I have to get him out of... All right, once we land, we'll get him out and let him do a little like sample surface test here. World's first milestones. What do we get? We've broken a speed record of 25 meters a second. Uh, we've launched our first vessel. We've broken a speed record of 80 meters a second. We kind of killed it. Look at that, 250 meters a second. Like, come on, bring it on. And we went 1,000 meters. We didn't really go up, you know? More kind of went like across, but hey, I'll take it. That's fine. That's a world first. Bring it on. All right. Yeah, Jebediah is eating good tonight. Let me tell you that much. Um, let's speed this up. Where do we go to speed this up? Let's warp it. Play a shortcut for that. A number pad? No, not the number pad. Uh, this the throttle. All right, hopefully we don't blow up on impact. This we're good. Yeah, uh, I think I can eject Jebediah, can I? Crew report. Let's transmit that, of course. What if we, I think we can transfer the crew, right? Well, hang on. Okay, no, that's good. Transfer crew. Uh, never mind, I can't do that. Hmm. Can't back out of that. Uh oh. Sweet. Okay. Uh, I would like to back out. Escape. There we go. Sweet. So, can I not eject my crew here? Can I not get them out? Uh, all right, maybe not, but we got we got a crew report, so let's abort the mission, or we can let's recover the vessel. Nice, so that's pretty good right there. We got some science, yeah, cool. Twelve science, fourteen. Uh, Twelve science, fourteen total. Did we get anything? We got full price for the recovery there. Uh, okay, cool. And then XP for Jebediah. It's gonna suck when Jebediah dies. Like, he's for sure gonna die. Turned to the surface, recovered our first crew from the mission. We performed the first of one of our experiments at home. Seems pretty good. Um. Contracts can... Ah, uh, this is what I needed before I did that launch. That was probably dumb of me. So... What is this? Take a crew report. I used to hate these contracts. Mainly because I could never navigate to where I needed, needed to go. And with that big old booster, I don't think I'm going to be able to navigate to where I need to go yet either. So let's take a different one. Um, into flight above. Okay, so the CEO and chief water, water bottle washer, chief bottle washer, a research and development department has stumbled on a problem. The manual clearly states that the RT-10 hammer solid fuel booster is the best in its class. To avoid legal complications, we're going to need to proof to justify our claims. This is where you come in. The goal of the contract is to haul the RT-10 Hammer Solid Fuel Booster into flight above Kerbin. Uh, we have about a day to do it. We have a year, I guess, but it expires in a day. Uh, flying altitude 22,000. And speed 300 to 440 meters a second. Okay. We get an advance of 6,000 urban dollars. Um, I 
don't know if I have that yet. It's also higher than I've been able to go, and we only made it to about 100 meters a second, so that's uh, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. pretty solid there. This one looks more like the height. The height for this one is 26,000 for the altitude. The speed is 150, which is achievable. Activate the part through a staging sequence when all test conditions are met. Mm, we're going to do the parachute for sure. Yes. Yes. What am I saying? Although, I mean, this one has two stars, like it's harder or something. Maybe that isn't, maybe that's just prestige. Yeah, we're going to do this one for sure. Prestige significant. Activate the part through the staging sequence when all test conditions are met. I mean, we just have to get to an altitude of 9,000 at a speed of 150 meters a second and activate activate the parachute. That's that's easy money right there. Can I take multiple? RT5. Mm -hmm. RT10. Can I do this as well? Okay, so we have multiple contracts here. So we have the RT10. Nice, so list them out. So we need to get the RT10 fuel booster and a flight above Kerbin. Okay. And then we need the parachute. See if little boy, little boy one is up to the task. We might already be making little boy two here. Uh, it was the RT10 that I needed, right? And this is, okay, it's a big boy. There's stage in here. Nice, that is solid. Ooh. Uh, do I wanna, I don't know, this might be a really dumb idea, but we're gonna do it. Why not? This is gonna blow us up for sure. That barely is any thrust also. But let's try it. I feel like I'm gonna need some serious aerodynamics going on. So the thrust is there. And I need, what does that mean? What is that? I don't know what that means. Ah, oh, that drops us so much, but I think I want, I don't want it up top. I guess maybe I want it towards, maybe I want the, uh, Oh, what is that, the aerodynamics? Maybe I want the aerodynamics where the mass is. And I see after the staging. Hmm, okay. Well, let's, uh, let's see what happens with this. This is a little boy too now. Not so little either, but we'll leave it as a little boy too. All right, Jebediah. RIP. Hopefully this will detach on its own. It should, right? It should, because I do not have a way. I don't have any couplings. All right, it's gonna cost 2,000, 2,500. We got plenty of money for that. Uh, what are the goals here? 22,000, we need to be going 300. So if we can just get a little altitude, then we can launch the big boy. Parachute, 13,000 for the parachute. Remember that, 13,000, activate the parachute. Okay, let's launch it. Uh, Turn on these. Oh God, we're already tilting. Oh God, we're already tilting. That's fine, we're good, we're good, we're good. Detach, 
Oh. That's how we do it right there. That was all planned. That was on purpose. This is bad. That's not good. That's, there we go. Stable out, stable out. Stability, yeah, good, good, not good, not good. We're, oh geez, oh geez, oh god. All right. That uh, contract didn't work. What's our speed here? We're good, we're good. Okay, cool, so that was bad. Yeah, that was not great. Hmm. We got some milestones. 3,000 meters. So I'm gonna take the little one off and just use the big boy right now. And we'll take a science experiment. I need to take a science experiment from the uh, launch pad as well. All right, good, we landed safely. I'm all about that. Crew report. Uh, I guess, hmm, I guess we just don't have anything going on because we're already, we're in this area. Ball's also rolling around, kind of freaking me out. Okay, we'll keep that experiment and then we will recover the vessel. That was not great. Definitely not. We got a little science though. And I guess we got some money back. We got, we lost about thousand dollars on that. It's not too bad. Did not get any XP. Okay. So we did not accomplish anything with that launch. Let's remove this. What does that do for rust? We, I wish I knew more about rust here. About aerodynamics. Do I want the aerodynamics to be where the mass is? What if I go a little above? Is that a smart idea or is that a dumb idea? Let's try it. Little boy, I guess technically like little boy three. Save it. Launch. We do a science experiment and then we will take off. Preserve that goo. Keep it. Can I get a crew report? Nice. Transmit that. Oh my gosh, what if I made him transfer like to the outside of the rocket and then launched? Jebediah, he's he's a man, he could handle it for sure. Alright, here we go. Let's try it. Already oh jeez. That might have been me. I tried to play with the keyboard a little bit to try to like stabilize things. I work. Ah, <clears throat> uh, I tried to decouple just to like deploy the parachute and save them. Opposite effect happened. Whoops. RIP. All right, we're going to try that again. That was uh, bad. This time he's going down with the ship, regardless what happens. All right, observe the goo. Get the crew report. Transmit that bad boy. I can't transmit. Cool. We'll just keep it. Watch. All right, man. So. The aerodynamics are off. They must you must have to put the aerodynamics to where the thrust is. He's gonna blow up. Oh god. Oh. Dang. Okay. So yeah, we're gonna lower the aerodynamics on this. Can I hello? Okay, cool. Vehicle assembly. He should still be alive, right? We're not just like killing a bunch of guys over and over again. So, let's do three of them, and aerodynamics and thrust. So if I put this to where the thrust is, is that good? Mm 
Let's see. Let's see what happens. On all this stuff. Launch it? That seems good. That looks good right there. That's what we want. Okay, so you want it down low. Also, we are fl Oh, no. Good, good. Stabilize. Stabilize. You got it. I believe. I believe. Oh. We're at 4,000 meters, and we have to get to what? Like 20,000? Oh, my gosh. All right, the parachute. We might be able to make the parachute. Can we get to 9,000? No, we can't. We're slowing down. But I think I can add the little, like, RT-5 rocket. I feel pretty... Oh, I should have done a science experiment. Just eject the... Oh, there. What do we got? Okay, cool. Um, I'm going to put another set of fins on. And then with the other set of fins, I'm going to put them to where... Uh, so, attach the rockets. Small one on the bottom. Shoot, I might even be able to do the big, the two big ones. I'll do a RT5 on the bottom, RT10 on top, and then the capsule. Fins at the bottom, fins in the middle, and we'll see what happens from there. Also, this is going to take forever. Oh my gosh. I guess let's deploy our parachute. I don't like that parachute blew up for a second. All right. And now we just wait. Uh, I guess we can abort, right? Can't we recover now? Can him recover till he lands? Cool. That was a good launch. Yeah, I feel like that was a solid launch right there. I've got a good idea of what I need to do now. Okay, so we're good there. Go ahead and recover the vessel. I feel like uh, Jebediah should get some XP from that. That was an intense launch. Uh, we got a little bit from that, and of course, no XP. Cool. Uh, what did we get on milestones? Altitude record of 2,000 and 7,000. I. I feel like we made progress on that. We didn't make it very high up, but I feel like I learned a lot on that. I'm just going to go for the big boy. Oh, but I don't have couplers. So that's going to explode. We'll see what happens, maybe? Dang, there is no lift on that either. What if I... Alright, next idea. What if I strap a bunch of these together? That's going to make aerodynamics the world's biggest headache. But yeah, what if I strap these together? Holy shit, look at this lift right here. So, okay. This is such a bad idea. Oh my gosh, this is the worst idea ever. So we've got these all strapped. Where's the... We take these. Can I get more? And put that on there. And then can I take another set of fins, maybe? I mean, maybe I don't need another set of fins. Ah, let's go for it. This is this is thick boy right here. Thick boy one. Prepare him for the launch. Launch it. I mean it seems good to me. This is probably gonna blow up. This is probably a terrible idea. Let's try it though. We have to have four rockets. There's no okay. Here's what's gonna happen. There's no way the stability control is gonna work on this. There's just no way. It's gonna be too much force all at once, and we're gonna get like whacked out of line and just 
blow up. Let's try it though. Oh, we're tilting. We're tilting. Stabilize. Oh no, here we go. Here we go. Oh. Oh, it's trying so hard to stabilize. Oh my gosh, it's trying so hard. We're flying right back down to Earth. Look at the force on this. Our boosters. This is going to be a successful launch at least. Alright, eject. Cool. Adios. That's going to go blow up some small, like, farmhouse. And then, I think I can do like a last second parachute here. 500. Oh god, oh god. I waited too long. Whoops. Alright, let's go back to vehicle assembly. That didn't work like I thought it would. The three is way too many. What if we do the babies? Ooh, let's do the baby ones. Let's do three baby ones. I'll put them like down low. There. What is, okay, question. What does that do to everything? Rust is still down there. We want these to actually go first. We want them all to go at the same time. Let's have them go first. It's not a lot of thrust, but yeah. Okay, so if that goes first, then we can take these. Okay, so. Bear with them. I think these are still, unfortunately, these are still going to be attached when that kicks off because I don't have coupling. Can I research that? I can probably research that. Alright, this is Thick Boy 2. Save it. Launch it. Let's see what happens. It's, I don't think this is going to get very high up because all the extra mass. On rotation, stability, launch. We're already tilting. Oh no. Okay. So, what happens when I kick that on? Oh, this is beautiful. This is great. Look at us. Oh, this is awesome. We're about halfway through the fuel right now. Oh, I mean, we're angled a little weird, maybe? But we're still, like, yes, we're booking it. We're going to get the parachute one for sure. I need to deploy the parachute. And where's our speed? My speed. Oh, my two. Ah, oh, dang it. I should have deployed earlier. That was my fault there. We pick up some speed. We got a thousand meters to pick up speed. Let's go get that speed up to 150, baby. Go, go, go. It's gonna get there. It's gonna get there for sure. We'll get up to 150. Maybe. Oh, I don't think we're gonna get it actually. Shoot, so close. Okay, so we'll have to do that launch again, but. That got us to where we need to go. To the parachute. We just need a little more altitude. That H10. I wonder if I could do the same type of design, but with the big boys instead of the little ones. So I'm deploy the chute just to be safe. Hey -oh. Uh, can we observe the goo? Give us anything? Crew report? Does this give us anything? Oh, nice. Maybe I haven't been over the grasslands yet? I don't know. I thought I had. 
Okay. That was a good launch. Good launch. I just barely missed the parachute, and that was just my fault there. Dang, look at all this. Okay. Let's recover the vessel. Okay, no, begin. No milestones on that either. So, let's juice it up some. Let's throw the big ones on there. We just do two. The thing I don't like about two is it seems really like, it doesn't seem symmetric, you know? Like what happens on the other sides? We can throw some fins on there and try it out. We're looking at mass, thrust. It's like, I don't know if this is actually a legit build here. That on there? Doesn't seem like it's doing anything. We're just gonna try this. And we want these two to go in the first stage. Ah, I wish we had some couplers. That's what I need to research. Let's save that and leave. Science at research and development. Uh, what gives us access to what? I probably want rocketry. The coupler, science is more science. Light control, ooh, so that would be kind of nice, right? Stabilizers. Looks complex as hell. I don't really care about the, uh, oh, but there's radial decouplers. Either way, I can get to that, so. Man, I don't, I'm not sure I really need more rockets right now. But I could, I mean, I could just, if I get this, I could just stack over and over again. Let's do this. Oh, and you have to purchase the parts. Oh, dang. Let's see. Purchase them all. Okay, I like that. I think that might be new. I don't remember that. More science. I have 20 science. We got going on here: service bay, parachutes, heat shields, landing strut. Oh, that should be awesome! I don't think I need that stuff yet, though. Radial decouplers, I can get. I don't want. Like, oh, do I not already have this? It seems like I already have that. Just research, get the parts. 15 science, I could get the survivability going on here. Let's see though, we're gonna save that. Okay, should have a bigger arsenal to play with now. Nice, nice, nice. We don't have any, okay. Oh, we do have some fuel tanks. Oh, I think I want to just have what I have right now, though. I feel like I had a good thing going on. Oh, do I have the radial decouplers? I don't. Okay, we're going to try this way. Uh, versatile... Mass, there's like no mass on this, so it's... Okay. That's thrown on. Thermostat, sure, we can throw that on as well. Cool. Uh... Let's try this. Let's continue with this real quick. If this doesn't work, 
then we can go to uh, we can go to like stack and everything and decouple and everything. All right, stability on launch. Let's do it. And we're immediately tilting. Oh. So the fins on the side probably don't work. We're not really like, we're just kind of moving sideways. This is my plan actually. This is how we're gonna circumnavigate the globe. Uh, resist, that doesn't do anything. Oh, God. Cool, hey, the booster survived. Oh, never mind. All right, we're gonna go back to the drawing board there. I'm gonna throw some more fins on it. We're already running with with like this design. We might as well just keep it going. So give me some fins. Let's go. Mass aerodynamics. I think we need fins going this way. Like, does this double them up? Yeah, that brings the that way up. Get them here as well. Oh no. Doesn't seem to be doing much here. Oh, that does like opposing sides, huh? All right, we're gonna save this and launch it. And let's do a little science reading before we launch, just in case. Gosh, where's the thermostat? Log temperature, cool. Double display. Oh, that's cool. All right. Let's get our stability. Off we go. More stable this time. We're tilting a little bit, but this is a lot more stable. Nice. So I just went in doubt. I guess just like throw on as many fins as humanly possible and we start flipping right now. Okay, never mind. I'm gonna stop talking. Still not going down, which is good. Okay, can we stabilize here? Is this gonna stabilize? Maybe stabilize for Oh uh, we're just like flying across right now. This doesn't we're actually flying down and across. This is not great. This is not where we wanna be right now. Kinda like pull up a little bit. What's going on? Alright, we're gonna eject from this. That it's just a missile going into the ground. Cool. Okay. So yeah, we just shot a missile into our planet on accident. <coughs> but yeah, okay. We need to go we need to go back to what we had before. For sure. Go crew report. Nothing cool about temperature. Okay. Temperature, overwrite temperature scan. Can I hit that? Oh, hell yeah. Look at that big ass antenna. Okay. Let's log temperature again. And let's speed this up. Okay, yeah, not ideal, not ideal, but we're making progress. So more fins was good, but we still eventually lost it. The thrust. I wonder if that's because like the mass changes or if that's just too complex. 
Might be too complex, right? Like if the mass changes as the fuel goes down in the rockets. I don't know if the game actually like count that. Okay, so oh uh oh. Analyze that, that's not good. Um more fins maybe? Let's throw more. Can be the most amateur rocket ever made. Pulls the thrust off to one side. We definitely don't want that. To do that is interesting. Huh? About in there, sure. I don't know. We'll go one more launch on this, and then we'll see what happens. Um, we may start fresh. Now that we have some decouplers, we should be able to get a nice rocket built, just like in a straight line, just like a huge monolith. Uh, we're tilting a little bit, but not bad. Yeah, not bad, actually. Ah, oh, man, I think that's the same point that we tilted at last time. Oh, that's rough. That's rough. Okay, we can kick this one in. What is that? Oh, hey, debris. I didn't know your debris stuck around. That's cool. And this is actually a very solid launch right now. What the heck? We really came back around on this one. We're not... Okay, never mind. We're not getting much altitude. And we're losing it. What? What the hell was that? Was that my parachute? No. Whew. I thought that was my parachute at first. Turn that off. Let that thing fly all over the place. Uh, science experiment? Hello? Uh, okay, nothing good. Crew report, anything? Let's keep that. We're gonna land in the water though. This might have been, might have been good to transmit. Oh well. Thermostat, low temperature. Keep that. Is it crew report? Can I, yeah, let's transmit it. Okay, never mind. Let's pull the shoot and warp. Nice, so this is gonna be like our first kind of like splashdown, maybe, maybe not. Look at that, we're gonna land on the beach. Perfect. Do a little vacation. We just took a rocket ship to get there. Shout out to Elon Musk and you know, like five years. It's just gonna be SpaceX right here. Oh, we are gonna land in the water. So I think we can do some science experiments if we land in the water, possibly. Can I transmit anything? Well, let me do that. Can't click. Uh, review report. Okay, let's do another crew report. Transmit that as well. Oh, I cannot. Okay. Let's keep the experiment. Let's do the little goo test. Am I on land or am I floating in the water? I'm Okay, let's keep that. And then where's our thermostat at? Let's review the data transmit. I'm out of power, aren't I? Log and keep it. Okay. We almost got to the parachute there. The parachute challenge, not quite.
Okay, next. Good, done. So, hmm. Let's go ahead and take all this. Uh, I want to just build a big rocket. I take, okay, let's take a coupler. Can't use that yet, never mind, but we'll put it there. I want a fuel tank. Where's my fuel tank? That's engines, payload, fuel, please. Where is fuel? Oh my god, where's fuel? Very well. Take a few of these. This is probably really inefficient and probably really expensive. What is a, what's a fuel boost? 400. So this right here is more expensive. I'm gonna have to throw the engine on. Oh my gosh, that's so much money. We're just gonna stack a bunch of boosters. Okay. So we're gonna launch this bad boy, decouple. Watch with that. Uh, is there like, there's probably diminishing returns, right? Like, there's a thrust on this now if I'm using it. I'm just like stacking them all. Oh yeah, that's big time diminishing. Let's do one more just because it's going to be really fun. Where's my decoupler? Even if I'll have the right weight to do this. And then we're gonna need fins at each stage. You see all of this. Okay, cool. Like mass probably doesn't matter much. I'm gonna put that down there. Another set that's right here. Ever I can get it on there. Okay. Another set, put that right here. One, two, sorry, that right. Please attach, please. Please attach, please. We'll put that right here. This is the most ridiculous rocket ever if this thing works. Uh the tall boy. Tall boy one. Save it and let's launch. Stability station this thing is going to be going to be so uneven. Oh god, we're already tilting a little bit. We're already tilting a little bit. Oh no. It's hanging in there though. We're tilting. We're going to get top heavy. We're about to get top heavy. It's going that way. Look at it slowly going. And detach. Oh no, I lost the other fins when I detached. Oh no. Launch. Oh, that was a bad idea, and I just detached it. Whoops. Maybe that'll be good though if it can peel apart. This is a disaster. Okay. Oh. Can we get some stability. Get some stability. Come on, come on. Not facing downward, please. It's not not what I want. 
That's not what I want at all. Ugh. Are we gonna survive this? Nope. All right. Well. All right. You do that. Vehicle assembly. I need to move those fins up. Did not mean for those to get detached like that. It also got like slightly worse every time that we tried to launch. Or every like stage that we went through. I'm pulling even more fans. Why not, right? It seemed like we got really top heavy. I don't know how you prevent that. that there and this is the most I don't think that's how you stop it from top baby it, but maybe there's some weight there what's the mass you can move the mass down I like I throw this on that's a terrible idea. We're not gonna do that. Nice, nice. Over 30 parts, cool. Get rid of that. What about now? We can eat. Oh, we got a milestone. Ocean, sweet. Um come back to this. Problem here, right? So that's there. Hmm. Yeah, the mass just isn't gonna work on this thing. I don't think I need these either. I just do like two here. And then two. See what happens. Okay, get the stability, rotation, there we go. We're already tilting. <laughs> that didn't work. Hmm. This is a weird spin now. Oh no, don't tell me we're gonna pull building. Please don't blow up the building. Oh, we're good. Sorry, guys. My bad. Alright. So, let's just get rid of this. Or, we can put it in there. Double, like what we were doing before. Do that and move it down potentially. Okay, get rid of the coupler. We'll do that in two stages though. And then bins seem like we're gonna need some more opening here. On the other side, that one. All right, let's try it. So far, so good. So far, really good, actually. We got a little rotation. Oh no. We got a lot of rotation. Oh. Oh, stay strong. Stay strong. We're still we're just being hyper inefficient, but look at that. 
Stabilize, come on, stabilize for me. Stabilize for me. Other one kicked in there. I feel like it's just one of them. We should be good here. No problem. We're at the right altitude. Too fast. Oh, interesting. Okay. Oh, man. Like the most inefficient rocket ever, but we're getting up there. We're doing it. Let's uh, detach. Parachute? Oh my gosh, that I was too high up on the altitude. That was so dumb of me. I just saw the speed and was like, oh, I better better deploy. Shoot, that was really dumb of me. We can relaunch that exact same rocket and just redo mission here. We almost got a 22,000. Not quite, but we almost got up there. Uh, can I do a temperature reading? Mr. U. Uh, temperature. Hmm. Yeah. Uh, yeah, temperature. Okay. And now we just float for it. Uh, I should be able to go back. Oh. oh, sea level versus mountains. I like it. Nice. I never knew. Okay. Recover. I think this is going to be the last launch of the night for me here. I think we can get this contract done on this launch. Let's just go ahead, same craft, relaunch it. Ah, uh, the fin part was interesting. Can we get another fin? Oof. Uh, hello? I'd really like it if I could get this fin to snap on. Let's throw this down. Okay, we're gonna try this. Save it. Uh, launch it. Got some decouplers, so it probably. All right, last launch of the night. Here we go. You gotta get to 9,000 feet and 150 meters a second. Then we deploy the chute. Let's do it. Ready. Looks good. This looks like the last one, although we uh, were tilting a little bit, I feel like, than the last one. Yeah. What the heck? How did we just get so jacked up on this one compared to the last one? Maybe the rockets were slightly off? Still going though, okay. The stability there. Where they're using that. Like move this stability assist, but it's not. Alright, and we're oof. This is a rough last launch here. So we kinda leveled out, so we might get some distance going. Yeah, I feel like we might get good distance. I guess when I put these boosters back on, they're slightly off. So that must have must have messed it up. Stayed on that a little while and tried to get a little more distance. But oh well. Hmm. Um. Temperature reading. Gosh, it's so hard to click. There's probably a better menu for this, is there not? Hmm. World's first milestones that we get. A 
land distance of 10k. Nice. We keep crashing over here. Thick boy 2, RIP. Yeah, we keep crashing in this area. Hmm. Oh, second to deploy the shoot there. We should be. Moon, man, we're gonna get there. We'll get there one day. That's for sure. All right, well, thanks for tuning in. Unfortunately, we couldn't quite complete that contract. Rocket didn't seem as good as the first launch, but next time we'll get it dialed in. We'll get those two contracts done. I think once we figure out uh, the launch is a little bit better, then we'll be solid. And we have 425 days to complete this, so we got all sorts of time. But with that, have a good night. Stay safe out there, and I'll catch you next time.